Now, Singapore's National Day Parade is returning to the Padang on the 9th of August, with organisers expecting the biggest turnout in four years. The Heartlands will be in on the celebrations as well. Sherlyn Xia is more, including a first listen to this year's theme song. call for Singaporeans to pursue their passions with a can-do spirit and also help others along the way. It's the main message in this year's NDP theme song, Shine Your Light. And it's a sequel from last year by the same composer. The significance of the song being even faster and, uh, in, in my opinion, uh, catchier and, 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 and more vibrant uh, is to really kind of like ignite the spirit uh, of, of all Singaporeans and, and to give them something to smile about at the same time, you know, something that's really nice and infectious. It's in line with this year's theme of Onward as One, to rally Singaporeans together and be resilient to challenges ahead. Coming out from the pandemic for the last three years, we want to give Singaporeans that confidence to look forward into the future, to move onward uh, together and also to build uh, a shared future. And uh, with this theme, uh, one of the uh, key aspects that you will see in, as part of our NDP is in our show segment, we will feature many stories of uh, our Singaporeans who are chasing their dreams, their passion, uh, giving back to society, serving as an inspiration for many of us. All that will take centre stage at the Padang, with setup now underway for the big day. It's expected to sit a live audience of 27,000. The Padang is also of historical and cultural significance because, well, if you recall, Singapore's first ever National Day Parade was held here in 1966. And the last time it was here in 2019, that was also the last full-scale parade before the pandemic hit. Almost a full circle moment now that it's back here four years later as Singapore has moved to fully live with the virus. A highlight this year will be the total defence segment. It will be in the form of a parade in contrast to previous year's displays. In addition to police and military assets, there will also be floats and short films in between. The aerial display will reach greater heights with more aircraft than previous years. It's to celebrate the Air Force's 55th anniversary. And in the Guard of Honor marching contingent, the Digital and Intelligence Service will make its debut. The celebrations will also be brought closer to homes at five heartland sites on the 5th and 6th of August. Residents can take part in carnivals and enjoy live performances. And then on the 9th, revel in firework displays.